Welcome. Eight artists remain. Three on the west, three on the midwest, and two on the east. Still here, baby. And one region has been completely wiped out. R.I.P. Jason. This race has been neck and neck, but ultimately, only one of you can earn $100,000, a feature in Inked Magazine, and the title of Ink Master. Just getting close. Almost there. This flash challenge, you will once again win or lose as a team. We're solid. This week, we are testing shading. It's a good week for us. Shading is denoting value between light and dark. It gives dimension and shape and form. I got two awesome black and gray artists on my team. Shading is all they do. Normally on this racetrack, to win, you have to burn rubber. But for you to win, you're going to need to burn bread. What the no way. Oh, we're making a toast? Today, you must create a massive monochromatic masterpiece, one piece of bread at a time. What? You're kidding me, right? I don't even eat bread. Carbs are bad for you. How do you think I look this good? Using nothing but bread, glue, and blow torches. What? Just light it on fire? You must toast each piece of bread to different shades, creating an impressive work of art with smooth gradients. Burn toast almost every single time I use a toaster. You expect me to do it by hand with fire? With fire. Just when you think it can't get worse, it just gets weirder. Today we're looking for you guys to be able to shade with your blow torches anything from very light to black. You can burn it and create your values. The key word that Nunez just used was values. We want to see a lot of gradients, a lot of smooth transition from dark to light. Think about that when you're designing your piece. The winners of this flash challenge will have the power to assign all of the human canvases in the elimination tattoo. That's big. Fail to have a solid game plan, and your entire piece could go up in flames. Not us today. You will have five hours, and your time starts now. For this flash challenge, we're getting crazy with it. I'm going to literally start putting the bread up completely. OK. OK. Today, these artists can really do something creative and do something amazing because of the way this bread reacts to the blowtorch. So we're looking for beautiful works of art. I'm thinking like a big, simple shape, something inside of it. And then what do you want to put inside of it? I don't know yet. We'll figure that out. OK. There's no reason why we can't see a creative design come to life in this medium. I want to do a rooster, dude. A rooster? I want to do a rooster. It's kind of cool. I was going to show shading. It's a bunch. What? There's a lot of shading in the rooster. Hey, remember how many times we've failed doing animals? Well, we have the ability to do so much detail with this shit. I want to do something realistic. I don't hate it. Uh, do you have any ideas? Anything you're thinking about? Um, I mean, I mean, what would be awesome if we could nail an owl, but because you could throw so many gradients in there. Without any reference, that'd be tough. There's a lot of upkeep that comes with keeping the team together. You're just more focusing here and here. Yeah. Bring a wing across where it swoops in. I'm definitely worried about Jarrell. I don't feel like we're all on the same page right now. You know, the head within like this range, you know, we put some talons and then just like his wing's swooping down. That's not bad. I'm doing everything that I can to make sure that he's happy. Jarrell, this is kind of your game, dude. Yeah, exactly. Four hours remaining, everybody. Four hours. What are you drawing? Drawing the coffee cup. You're not into the sandwich idea? I mean, I just don't know how we're going to be able to pull off the insides of it. We've got a lot of ideas going on here, and we just can't agree on one. What if we do a skull with a candle melting on it? I think that's kind of basic. Coffee cup, I think we just go for it. I'm into that. Toast and coffee. This is going to be a task. This is cool. It's going to stand really strong if it's like hella dark, you know what I mean? Yeah. We approach the challenge with a basic idea. And from that, we make all the decisions on the go. That's what you get when you have three good artists in one team. We're making sure that you see the darkest area and the lightest area, and we're going to put a lot of grace in between. That looks good, Harm. We're killing it. Two hours remaining. Two more hours. Oh, bread smells good. Ooh, this bread's all warm and shit. Mmm, <laughs> it's that warm bread.
my team spends the entire time in these challenges talking and joking. Roll me in butter and slap me up like a biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> that bothers me so much. I'm not into that. I feel like if you guys were to get the head, yeah. I mean, you could hit a wing, I can hit a wing. Kelly can start working the center. OK. Today, I'm calling the shots. We're going to do things the way I want to do them. Let's get it done. And this is your final hour. It needs to be brighter. What, it needs to be brighter? The eye. Because, like, the overspray from other shit just got it. We can cut new bread out. Like a shiny right here? Yeah, I like a, just a dot of fresh bread. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, that looks a lot better. Perfect. It pops. Ah, good touch. The eyes? Yeah, somebody from the West showed me how to do that. Hey, I want you guys to win if we don't. Team East is down to two people, so my game plan now is to try to rely heavily on my alliance, and hopefully, with their help, we can keep everybody afloat. <sighs> that like an edge right there. Damn it, there's still buddies over there. I hate it. It's us versus them. When hasn't it been? Five, four, three, two, one. That's it. Time is up. Toast and coffee. Yeah, it's a perfect pair. All right. Uh, I'm stoked on it, man. I think they stole my idea of cutting out those little highlights. Yeah, we did. Yes, you did. It was you, no Frank? Shame. God I stole damn it, it. Oh, yeah. Frank. No shame. God yeah, that's, damn it, Frank. That's flattery, right?